Hey Cancers, welcome to your reading. If you're new, welcome. Please remember to subscribe and to my lovely loyal subscribers, welcome back guys. I told you we will be, oh it's flipped. Uh, I told you we will be, if we reach 100,000 subscribers, I'll go live at the Eiffel Tower. So that's what we will be doing tomorrow night. If you'd like to join in the festivities, if you're not doing anything else, make sure you're subscribed so that you can get the update when I go live. Okay, so we have five of pentacles reversed, nine of pentacles there, and the magician here. Um, so it seems that somebody who was left out in the cold here is now single here. Um, so it, it might be you or your soulmate. We know the roles can be reversed in general readings here, but somebody is like, I'm single, single. <laughs> I ain't had no offers that I'm interested in. I'm single, single. I've been working on my money. Might not be so great, but I've been working on it and I'm manifesting a better new year here. Um, awareness is the magician. So let's see what we have for your pentacles turning over. Yeah, um, you and your soulmate have been doing the same thing, working very hard. Um, you might not even know them yet, uh, but the three suggest union going to happen. You're going to come out of the cold here. Uh, yeah, you're not seeing it yet. There's some surprises in store for you guys in 2022. Um, I definitely feel like this is like the 1st of January here showing us this one. Uh, you're putting all this behind you. Definitely some deep feelings here, some going on with the moon. We're going to see. Uh, six of pentacles yeah good money energy coming in as we're working through capricorn season so i feel like you know new year's day you'll just be like ah oh, 2021 finally behind me <laughs> like exhaling or something here yeah princess of wands but don't worry the universe is going to start new things there's going to be lots of new beginnings here and somebody is going to message you or be flirting with you here um letting you know the six is also related to the lovers but it's our service to humanity so you might have been focused on finances and career uh for the last part of the year here um money could be coming up good now uh, with this nine of pentacles if you've worked very hard you may see a reward here um, because that is material harvest but princess of wands it's getting into something new creating something new on that magician there so let's see four of swords the tower this is unexpected to you ace of pentacles wow this is what we want to see so although you're like i'm single single stephanie uh there's nobody making me any offers yeah, this is, you had to wait and heal first. There was just a little bit of healing, so um, it was more like working on yourself. So it's going to be <laughs> a very big surprise when this offer comes in. Um, it's going to change your world around. That's the tower here. If some of you have been left out in the cold, it may be because you found out some secrets about a third party situation. Somebody giving their energy um, to somebody younger. Uh, so... I feel like you could be trying to manifest a text from them, but you need time to heal. Um, this tower would suggest, you know, you've been completely shocked that this person is ghosting you um, when you've made them an offer and they're just like playing dead. Uh, they're a real ghost here that like, uh -uh, I'm not answering any messages. So that would be the tower. If you are freshly out in the cold by somebody, somebody is ignoring you or if you're freshly single. But if you've been long term single, this is an offer coming in. It's the extreme opposite. You're not expecting this offer. And that's why it's shocking to you. Um, but with, with the moon, it's saying, you know, just because it hasn't been revealed to you yet doesn't mean it won't be. Uh, strength card here. So this is about taming any negative thoughts within ourselves. Um, it's the eighth house, Scorpio there. So maybe even a message coming in from a Scorpio or meeting a Scorpio who's about to fall in love with you. Uh, it could be a Pisces or a, a Leo here. Um, all the signs will generally come out, guys, um, in general readings anyway. So yeah, this is somebody is interested in you so any negative thoughts like i'm going to be single forever there's nobody out there for me uh you need to stop that now because somebody's going to come in um either with an apology here um so if you've been through this breakup and this third party situation <clears throat> maybe that a ghost apologizes to you like hey i'm sorry i did what i did um others of you this is a new relationship coming in that's completely unexpected 
that this person feels this way about you uh, and they're making such a huge offer here with the ace of pentacles good money again with the ace of pentacles as well two of swords don't let indecision hold you back okay let's just say that if you've been single single a long time three or four years and you're saying well i might be waiting on a divine partner it's okay to have new experiences as well um so this is why other people make you offers and other soulmates come into your life. We don't just have one. Um, so I feel like there's an offer you're not expecting to come here. Um, but again, we see, I would say if this is a twin flame connection, and I don't really do that in my general readings, but there is two pages here. So if it is a twin flame connection, I feel like you guys might have been in separation a long time or no communication a long time. Uh, you might reach out and say happy new year or they might okay Zana you are protected from all types of harm the worst is now behind you I ask you to relax and feel safe so yeah some of you you know have been going through it with that five of pentacles being left out in the cold somebody ghosting you here I mean if you need an apology from a ghost that is really going through it right okay let's see Idriel, you are a light worker. God needs you to shine your divine light and love like an angel upon the earth and its inhabitants there. So probably these experiences are to get you to turn towards your divine path. And Sonia, I bring you a message from your deceased loved one. I am happy, at peace, and I love you very much. Please don't worry about me. So maybe that's literally a ghost um, who is around you um, and sending you love from the other side at this time of year. Okay? Happy New Year, guys. Remember, if you want to join in on the live, make sure you're subscribed. If not, Happy New Year.